Oh, uh, you, you guys ready for Uber? Uber Eats? Oh, do you have the code? Uh, uh, you don't have the code? Oh, I'm blind. I mean, what was the number again? Six four two six. Six four two six. Oh, that's not. Uh, I don't think you you're, you're not that person, right? Oh no. All right. We're not getting any orders right now. We only did two orders right now. We only did two orders. For the people out there that are trying to do these deliveries, make sure you guys do DoorDash because DoorDash is paying $30 an hour. I'm really not sure if DoorDash is gonna follow the same thing that Uber Eats did, lowering from $30 to $18 an hour active time, which really sucks. Um, I'm getting wet, my hands are cold, my feet are soaking wet. As you guys can see, my glasses right now, they're super wet. Um, luckily, you know, again, we decided to go with the Dime Bar. The Nine Bot is. This scooter, you guys, this scooter is meant for warfare, honestly. Let me know what you guys um, think about this whole mandate, this whole regulation, um, paying hourly active time. Standing shoulder to shoulder, fists raised in the air, New York's delivery workers have one goal getting their companies to raise their minimum wage to $30 an hour. So you think that the Deliverista activist group did the right choice, you know, uh, because this is all. Because you know this whole hourly mandate is because of them, because of that activist group. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Oh, we got a fire! Look at that! Holy cow! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Anyways, let me know what you guys think about the Deliverista group. Do you think they made the right decision of making this delivery gig hourly? Hold on. Let's see what happens here, man. We gotta wait right here. Let's see what happens. You got Shake Shack. Ugh, Shake Shack. I am not gonna pick no order from Shake Shack. Even though the way is good. Before, we should, <laughs> the bad restaurants that waited so long, we should get away from though. Now, we take those orders now. Man, I'm gonna put my, I'm gonna put my gloves on, man. I'm not gonna freeze my hands. Man, it is snowing. This is the first time ever I'm doing deliveries in the snow. This is the first time that I'm doing this deli these deliveries in the snow. I'm hoping that I'm getting tips. I'm hoping that <laughs> that these guys that these customers tip us. But it's snowing, you guys. It's slushy. We are definitely gonna take our time doing these deliveries. I oh hell no. Oh my god, this is what I do for the channel. Oh my god, this is what I do for the channel. We are literally going eight miles an hour. I am not gonna die for nobody today. Where's Rican? Rican! Guys, why do I do this? Why do we do this? Oh my goodness. Excuse me! Excuse me! <laughs> oh, I have waited long enough for two more orders. I'm gonna complete these two orders and then we're going home. I love it, I love it too. But what I do love is this fabulous snow. Excuse me, I'm sorry. I love this fabulous snow that other sun just went away right now. All oh, this snow just went away. All right, we got a red light. Yeah. Let's make that money. Give me more red lights. So we got another order. We got a five dollar order. It's less than a mile. I'm gonna do it. And I'm gonna take my time on it. Oh my God, it is super. My hands are freezing. Ready, one minute. Oh, I'm gonna take it. Take five minutes. <laughs> take five minutes. No, 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 no. Grab it right now. Oh, they have it? Oh one man. Minute. Come on, man. I get paid hourly now. Yeah, we're getting paid hourly now. We, yeah. you take it off oh no, no Brian, Brian okay yeah. how everyone doing we got sake right here we got a drink sake? we got a drink soy sauce, oh no soy sauce give me give me a shot give me a shot of sake oh, yeah no, no, no. no. vinegar <laughs> <laughs> all right everybody so what do we got all right cool all right y'all 
Uh, have a good one, Brian. Guys, my back is killing me. I think because of the door trying to go pro. Because of the door trying to go pro. We live in the fifth floor with no elevator, right? So I think honestly you guys I think I might have pulled a muscle. I think I pulled my muscle um carrying my Duotron Eagle Pro 5 flights, man. Cuz my back is hurting me. I think I pinch a nerve or something like that. I'm not sure. So we're waiting on this red light. We got 17 seconds to go. I don't know if you guys can see it right there. Time equals money. Uh-oh, we got another order right now. Hold on. Damn, seven. Oh hell no. Two miles? No, we're not doing that. <laughs> We're not doing that, guys. Well, I think this is gonna be my last order, honestly. Yo, what up, bro? You just said you pulled a muscle? Yeah. Yo, I got something for that. Oh, no, no, what is it? No, it's not no drugs or nothing. Xanax. Xanax? Oh. Muscle relaxing, brother. Nah, I'm alright, bro. Thanks, though. Thanks for looking out for me, bro. What's your name? They call me Polite, man. Polite? I just moved here from North Carolina. Oh, yeah? I love North Carolina. You ever been? Huh? Oh man, I go there all the time, man. Uh, Greensboro. My daughter was born in Greensboro Hospital. But yo, I got a delivery right now. I need to get going. Yo, God bless, bro. All right, man. I don't even have cash to buy Xanax. <laughs> right with Anthony on drugs, you guys. Oh man. Transition. What's up, everybody? It's Rican with Anthony live in Times Square to give you a special announcement. That's right, you guys. Apollo Phantom V. Three. Thank you so much Apollo Scooters for sponsoring us with this awesome partnership with Ride With Anthony. That's right you guys, in the link in the description you can check out the reviews of the Apollo Phantom V3. Check it out you guys, you won't be disappointed. This scooter got quadruple suspension, that's right you guys, 52 volts, 40 miles per hour, 40 mile range. Anyways, back to our regular programming. Hey, you guys. Honestly speaking, I know I might start contradicting at some points, but I actually like active time. Because look, I'm going like 8 miles an hour. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, sometimes I like it and sometimes I don't. This is the reason why I like it. Sometimes these oh, I don't even know what I'm saying no more, you guys. I'm sorry. But what I'm trying to say is the active time going slow works in our favor. Honestly. Man, yo, but I can't, I, I, I can't hardly see a thing. But honestly, I like, I like the dinner shift. There's less cars, less traffic. Oh, oh! Oh my God! Hello. Hello. Hi. Uh, I have a message. They gotta come and pick it down. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. All right, cool. Oh, I got multiple orders here. Hold on. All right, let me take a picture. What's up, man? Here you go. Here you got it. Okay. Thank you. I'm waiting on the red light right there. I could literally jaywalk, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to because time equals money. Right now we got an order on the bag. We're just taking our time right now. Oops. We're gonna take our time because time equals money. You know. Not like these people. You know. They. You know. They want to cut through traffic. Want to cut through lanes. Go through the red light. You know. We're just gonna make our money like this. If they want to lower the pay at $18 an hour, you can't, you know, you can't beat the system. What's up, bro? Got okay. yeah, delivery. Man, I'm taking my time today, man. Okay, right, yeah. 42, 42, 42, 42. you got 21, but I'm taking my time, bro. Yeah, I hear you, I hear you. You got to do that shit sometimes, bro. Yeah, just take the edge off. For real, man. You gotta take the pressure off your shoulders. Okay. And as long as you at least working. Yeah. And, the, and the adjustment. I can't believe it took the they lowered it. Yeah, yeah man. The 30 was great. Yeah. 30 was great, man. Now they lowered it to 18. Yeah. You're doing Uber? Yeah, Grubhub. So, I heard Grubhub is at, uh, where it's at right now, too. Yeah, it is crazy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's my best. That's my favorite one, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. How much is it, is it on hourly over there? Same thing. Oh, 30? Oh, uh, no, 18. Oh, but, but you got more orders. With the tips, and yeah, and it keeps ringing, and with the tips, you still you get like all together like 30. You know? Oh, yeah. Yeah. It could be like a little bit slow sometimes, but it's pretty good, bro, most of the time. Especially if you got electric uh, moped. Yeah, I'm on a e scooter right now. Nice, yeah. So I just went 10 miles an hour, man. Yeah. 
I'm milking this shit, man. Oh, yeah. You gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. I gotta get my e bike up and running again. Oh, Thanks yeah. I'm pedaling too much shit. I'm exhausted. Yeah, man. Take your time, bro. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I guess this was it, you know. Let me know in the comment section. Do you think that the Liberista group um, did the right thing setting this whole um, Uber Eats, DoorDash, delivery food gig, hourly pay rate? Um, this is the result. Not that many people are happy. There's some people that are happy with it. But if you guys are doing this as a living, like I said before, it's not a right move. Look for another career path because here in New York City, doing Uber Eats, DoorDash, food, any type of food delivery on an e-bike or an e-scooter or even on a moped is really, really risky here, especially here in New York City. So please, please, please be careful. Um, yeah. Anyways, we gotta get out of here. I'm gonna put the door. I'm gonna, anyways, we gotta get out of here. I'm gonna put the Segway away. I'm not gonna ride it. I'm not gonna ride it back home. It's super cold outside and it's like, I think this is like raining and snowing at the same time. Anyways, you guys, if you guys made it this far, please, please, please um, subscribe to the channel or any questions or concerns, share down in the comment section. Anyways, on to the next one. With riding with Anthony. Ride safe and stay safe. Oh, my God.